All right. Now we're about to load the uh, the desktop version of Plex. Keep in mind, this is not the server. This is still the streaming the streaming uh, client. Okay, there go my libraries. Now, like I said, uh, it doesn't support the same user interface as the, the PS3 version or the Roku version. But as you see, this version looked just as good as the Roku version. Um, so let's just say you have a computer with an HDMI port for the uh, for video feed. So if you're if you you know you if you're doing what I used to do, hook the computer up to the TV and watch your movies like that. I, it was a long time when I was doing that. It was a long, long time ago. But anyway, if you're doing it that way, then it still looks good. It's still, uh, still impressive. So there you go. Um, what else can I tell you about this PC version? Well, I'm sorry. This is the OS X version, but it looks just like the PC version. I mean, it's pretty much the same thing um oh by the way this officially is supposed to be running on an Intel Mac but I am not running this on an Intel Mac I'm actually running this on a power PC a power PC Mac and I will show you to prove it this is actually a power Mac G5 with dual processing Hold up. I don't know if you can see that clearly but I'm doing my best here but there you go. So this is not an Intel Mac. You can find the unofficial version uh, of this client on the internet. That's how I found it. So if you got if you got a, a G5, a Power Mac G5, you could put that thing to use and uh, put Plex on here. I don't know if they have a server, the Plex server for this, and I don't think I would even try it. But anyway, just wanted to show you that. Alright, so let's move on.